Hello owners, just want to give you an update from Pelican Sound on our projects for this week. So here's some updates for the Racket Center and Golf Clubhouse. We've had a lot of progress at the Racket Center. Here's a video to show some of the progress. Hi, I'm Neil Harrell with Envirostruct. Pleased to be your project manager here at the Pelican Sound Projects. We're here on the home stretch of the Racket Club phase of the project. Uh, really excited for the, the outcome that we've uh, achieved here. Uh, just a few weeks from delivering this nice project to you folks. And here's Eric for some update on the remaining details for you. Thank you very much. We are located in the tennis court area. This is uh, the outside perimeter. The uh, berm has been uh, sodded and then all the trees and plantscapes. And as we pan over here, we'll have in between the courts, we'll have uh, rock. And if you can see over, if you pan over to the courts, we're starting to put up the uh, windscreens and we have logos on some of the windscreens. So take a look. Fans are going in. Once the electrical is plumbed in, the uh, ice machine water station will go to the center uh, of the concrete. We're, we're located at the swell area. Uh, as you can see, all the uh, cabbage palms have been planted. And then uh, along the berm area, we have pink millie with pine straw to give it a nice effect. Now we have plantings going in, sod. Uh, all the plants and then the uh, maintenance shed is being installed. The, the hardy plank will be put on the side of the building. They'll start painting it and there'll be a garage door on this side of the building. All right, we have hardy plank going in right now. They're just finishing up the last boards and uh, we should be finished by the end of the week. We are located in the multi-purpose room called Courtside. You can see all the trim work has been painted. The walls have been painted as well. All the flooring is in and we're starting to put in some furniture. The audiovisual will have a projector in this room and there'll be a projector screen coming down. We just have some window treatments and then all the paintings as well. We are in the pro shop space. You can see the slat wall and the cabinetry is going in. Uh, later on Tuesday we'll have the uh, pro shop desk and some display pieces as well. And then an artwork we're waiting for the last minute to put, it, to put in the TV. And the ceiling actually is going to be replaced with the uh, new grid ceiling that's more of a darker gray color. This is just temporary until the product comes in so we can get our certificate of occupancy. We are located in the kitchenette area. You can see some of the equipment has come in, some of the coolers. We have a hot box that you can keep hot food hot. And these are refrigerators that we can use uh, for uh, cold displays and then beverages as well. If you pan over here, this will be, be able to use for uh, bar service. We'll be putting in a little coffee and tea brewer. And this will be a, a pickup window when we have events that you can use this for bar service. And then we have a three compartment sink being installed and a hand sink. So moving forward. We're located in the ladies restroom. You can see the uh, toilets being put in, the sink, the uh, showers being in, installed, as long with the uh, small cabinetry for some accessories and then uh, the partitions are in and last touches are being installed now. Located in the men's restroom, they're going to be installing the urinal soon. Uh, all the partitions are in and the mirror is going to be installed, but uh, walls are primed and ready to go and flooring's in, just finishing up. We're at the front of the racket center. You can see all the pavers are installed in the front. The hardy plank is all installed, the uh, uh, paint is all on the building, the landscaping is being installed, and then we're finishing up with the steps. There will be an inlay of the soldier course of the pavers very soon. All right, we're putting in the second lift of asphalt. Uh, striping will begin on uh, Monday, and the roadway should be all set to go. So at the Racket Center, a lot of things have been completed. The building paver installation is 100% complete. The concrete sidewalks are all installed. 
the hardy plank siding is installed the landscaping is about 90 percent complete they have some finishing touching and some sod work that they'll continue to do on saturday the kitchen equipment is on site and it's starting the progress of being installed they have the plumbing to still do the furniture is on site and they're still doing some installation as we speak the final lift of asphalt was done today and they'll come back on monday to do the striping the exterior paint is about 90 percent complete the interior painting is 100 percent uh, done they just have to do some touch-ups around some areas the ceiling is installed they do have to come back and uh, replace the pro shop but right now we're just trying to get our certificate of occupancy so we'll leave the ceiling how it is at this point in time the pro shop slat wall and cabinetry is installed they'll come back on Tuesday to start installing the pro shop desk. So at the racket center, we have some open items. The maintenance building uh, installation is still in progress. They have to finish up some of the hardy plank, which is the siding. They're installing the garage door and they'll uh, start the painting progress uh, this week or at the end of uh, next week. The kitchenette is in progress. They just have to do the plumbing. The pro shop desk will be installed on February 5th. The tongue and groove, which is the wood ceiling on the patio area, is being finished up. They should be done by Monday. The striping and signage for the roadway uh, will be uh, completed on February 4th. The plumbing fixtures, again, are in progress. And railing install is in progress as we speak. For the Racket Center, our continuing goal is to be open the week of February 18th. This is all subject to inspections and approvals. Here are some updates from the Golf Clubhouse. We are at the Golf Club. Uh, beams are going in. And the uh, second lift of tie beam is being installed. They'll be pouring uh, over the weekend. And uh, I'll take you over to the other side over here. All right, we're located in the view. This is our multi-purpose space. You can kind of see if you look out here, this has a perfect view of Lakes Nine, and it's just a beautiful spot. We are located on the patio at the new golf club. We have the planters uh, installed. Uh, this is will be some nice, beautiful landscaping. And we'll have right in the center some of the uh, fire pits. So you have four different sections throughout, so a beautiful space. We are in the pavilion space. You can see all the uh, footers are put in. And you can kind of really see how the, uh, the whole space really brings you to the uh, car, path, car path area. Located in the pavilion, in this space right here is going to be where all the seating is around the perimeter. And over here, this is the restaurant. And you have perfect views of the kitchen. Uh, we're located where the uh, pavilion grease traps are. are. You probably saw these big uh, block structures. So there's three for the new uh, pavilion kitchen. So status from the golf club, uh, some items that have been completed. The structural steel for the roof trusses are in progress. Steel columns are in place. All stem wall and planter wall footers are poured. The grease traps are in progress. And as far as open items, again, the roof trusses are in production at Universal Timber Structures out in Melbourne, Florida. They should be here by February 15th. We're preparing for the second lift of tie beams. All retaining walls and block are in progress. And we're starting the infrastructure work that you saw in the video with the grease trap, the storm drainage and sewer tie-ins and fire line tie-ins as well. And our target still for the uh, golf clubhouse is uh, completed by September 2019. I hope you all enjoyed the video and, and saw the highlights that we had. We're just at the home stretch at the Racket Center. Just a few more weeks and we'll be able to open that facility. I do want to note that it's very imperative that you do not walk on the property until we're 100% complete because there's still some very dangerous areas to be aware of. So thank you very much and enjoy your weekend.